Hi. Hi there. I'm here to pick up a prescription. Hi, I'm Lindsay. I'm your pharmacist. Hi, I'm Ryan Oriel. Ryan Oriel. Are mm -hmm. you picking up for you or yourself today? No, uh, my son Billy. Okay, okay. Well, do you mind if I take just a few minutes to sit down with you and discuss this new medication for Billy? Uh, with me? Well, my wife usually is the one who handles this kind of stuff. Well, I think that I can give it to you in such a way that you can probably feed it back to her. And after that, if she has any questions, I'm going to give you some great things at the end that she can use as resources. Okay. Okay. Great. Well, okay. thank you. Have a seat. All righty. <clears throat> so while I've got you here, just yes. verify the information to make sure we've got everything correct. Sure. Your son is Billy Oriel. Correct. You're Ryan, the father. Mm -hmm. This is your address mm -hmm. and phone number. Correct. And this is correct date of birth, right? Yep. Okay. Mm -hmm. And I see that the doctor has prescribed some Concerta, 18 milligram tablets. That is a brand name for generic methylphenidate. Okay. Okay. So what did the doctor tell you or your wife that this medication would be for? Billy? Oh, well, yeah, I wasn't there at the appointment, but, um, you know, Billy's been having trouble. He's handing in homework late or incomplete. <coughs> no problem. Um, he, uh, you know, it's not like he's running around the classroom, but he, uh, the teacher says uh, he just sits there like it is in like his own maybe world. Maybe having trouble focusing in class? Yeah, okay. yeah. I mean, he's really good at sports, and mm -hmm. I, I want him to do, I don't want his academics to hold him back. Understandable. Uh, you know, he's going to have to focus on sports, mm -hmm. too, and, and uh, you know, his academics. Well, this Concerta is going to be great for that because it's for ADHD. That's okay. Attention Deficit Hyperactivity Disorder. Okay. And this will be great for him because it will help him to focus on school as well as sports. So, Alrighty. did, um, how, what did the, how did the doctor tell you to take the medication to tell him? No okay. idea. We're going to get it no. down really good so you can tell your wife so that okay. she can be in charge of that. All right, so we're going to take one tablet. This is what they look like. I can get it open there. Okay. So you'll be familiar with that. Sure. Once a day in the morning. Okay. I'm going to take it in the morning so it'll be effective throughout the day. Mm -hmm. And um, if he misses a dose yeah. and it's before 6 p.m. that day, he can go ahead and take one. But if it's after 6 p.m. when he realizes he's missed it, wait until the next day to take it because okay. it may cause him to not sleep. You okay. don't want that either. Yeah, I mean, mornings in our house are crazy. And when he, when he gets on this medication as well, um, he won't want to discontinue it abruptly. So if he has some sort of f side effects that he may experience, like a headache, dizziness, or nausea, make sure that your, your wife take him to the doctor and they can maybe get him off of it or change it to something else. Okay. Okay? Okay. So to make sure that I've told you so yeah. that you can relay back to your wife everything that you need to know about this medication, would you kind of repeat back to me how we're going to have Billy take this? Okay. Well, once a day in the morning. Mm -hmm. uh, don't take it after 6 p.m. Mm -hmm. uh, so I guess if he misses, uh, try and take it close to that time. But if it's after 6, don't. Right. So then he would just skip it and mm -hmm. take it the next day. Right. What else? What am I missing? I think you've got everything. Okay. Um, once a day, early in the morning, mm -hmm. so when he wakes up, so he'll be good and primed for school and okay. after for sports. This mm -hmm. will also help him in sports, helping him be more focused as well. Good. So that's great. Okay. And don't take it if it's been past six, and right. with or without food. Okay. It doesn't matter. It's not going to affect it. Okay. So that's great. So on this, we have, there are no refills because okay. this is one that each time the doctor has to prescribe it. So uh, whenever he gets low, he can call me or the doctor, and we can work with him to get one. Well, how long do you think he'll have to take it? I mean, it's, forever? Or? It's something that he might, they might take it, and it might, as he gets older, he, the ADHD may improve, okay. or it may be something he's on long term. It's not necessarily a bad thing, or there's no stigma involved with it. It's just there to help him, cooperate, him you know, be involved and focus. Okay. So it's a good thing. So lastly, Mr. Oriel, I want to draw you to the new feature of our prescription label here. Mm -hmm. It's a QR code that you can scan with your tablet or smartphone when you get home with your wife, and it'll pull up all of the information we just went over specific to this prescription and Billy's profile. Okay. All of that dosing and all of that. And as well, I want to give you um, my card in case you or her have any questions about this or any okay. other medications. You just let me know. Awesome. Sound good? It does. Thank there you. you. Go. I appreciate it. Thank you so it. much. I'm glad I get to be your pharmacist. Yeah, it was good meeting you.